Well, I'm here today to celebrate 400 subscribers. And that might seem like a slightly random number to celebrate. Why not wait until a nice round, even 500? Well, if you saw my video a few months back where I showed my travel art bag, uh, you might recognize this clip. Well, if YouTube has recommended this video for you, I'm guessing that you've already watched a ton of videos about travel art kits because let's be honest I've only got four subscribers not 400 not 4,000 four <laughs> so YouTube's really scraping the bottom of the barrel recommending my video for you but I hope you'll stick around anyway and some of you have said that it was that actual moment when I talked about YouTube scraping the bottom of the barrel to show you my video that actually made you want to subscribe to my channel and now here we are about four months later and there's 400 of you. I never thought that would happen, but what a lovely way to end the year. And I'm so grateful to all of you for your lovely comments from wherever you are in the world. And I, I know obviously the internet and YouTube is a global thing. And so it shouldn't surprise me that some of you live a really long way from where I do, but strangely it did still surprise me. And I love it when you tell me where you're watching from and so much so in fact that I've actually done a map and I've I've coloured in like for, for people who've told me either what country or what state they're watching from I've, I've coloured in so if you've not told me where you are then please comment below and just let me know so I can add you to my map um, I'll, I'll put a, a screenshot of, uh, of the map at the end of the video so you can have a a better look to see if your area is already coloured in or not but yeah I'd love to I'd love to add you to my map if you're not already on there. It's been great fun watching the numbers of subscribers grow but what I've loved more than anything is reading your comments. The fact that you've taken time to write to me in, in the comments really does mean a lot and especially when your comments have been about something that I was perhaps feeling a little bit nervous about in the video so, for example, when I was showing my Inktober sketches and quite a lot of you commented that you loved hearing the stories behind why I'd chosen the pictures. And that was good for me because I was concerned that I was chatting too much and people wouldn't be interested. So it was nice to know that you did actually enjoy that part. And I especially like the comments where people said that listening to me talking about my holiday sketches for example that they felt like it was they were sat having a chat with a friend over a coffee listening to my holiday stories and again you know I, I thought I'm being too chatty you know people just want to see the sketches they don't want to hear your life story Laura but actually it seems like you do <laughs> and also so many of you have commented about my videos being calming and relaxing and again, that's meant a lot to me because I worry that my videos are boring. And I know there's a fine line between being calm and being boring. And there are probably a lot of people who do find my videos boring. And then they just, you know, they start watching the video and then that's not for them and they'll leave, which is fine. Um, and they, they've not hung around to leave negative comments either, which is nice. <laughs> And of course, it's it's lovely reading all the positive comments. But I also want you to feel free to comment if there's anything that you think I could improve or any suggestions that you think would help me. Because obviously my goal is to help encourage you to do more creatively, whether it's to learn a new skill or to practice a skill that you've already started learning. And then in return, you can help me to improve the quality of my videos because this is something that I'm very new at and I don't really know what I'm doing still. So you can help me with that. And then once again, thank you all for being so kind and supportive. It really means a lot. And uh, like I say, it's a lovely way to, to finish off the year. So hopefully I will see you all again very soon.